Marriage equality turns one week old in New Jersey, and before the year is over, we could gain marriage in New Mexico, Illinois, and Hawaii. Plus, there's a new lawsuit in Tennessee and progress in Nevada. At the American Foundation for Equal Rights, I'm Matt Baum, and welcome to Marriage News Watch for October 28, 2013. AFER's attorneys filed a brief in the Virginia marriage case last week. Just like DOMA, the brief argues, Virginia's marriage ban demeans same-sex couples, places them in an unstable position, humiliates tens of thousands of children now being raised by same-sex couples, and instructs all persons with whom same-sex couples interact that their relationships are less worthy than the relationships of others. We've made it through the first week of marriage equality in New Jersey, and a new survey shows strong public support. The Rutgers-Eagleton data show 61% of voters favor marriage for gay and lesbian couples, with just 27% opposed. That's the lowest point yet. The New Mexico Supreme Court heard arguments regarding marriage equality last week in response to several counties that either chose or were ordered to begin issuing licenses. At the hearing, the justices were skeptical of claims that banning marriage can encourage procreation and questioned whether a ban could have any rational basis. The court hasn't announced any uh, deadline for issuing a ruling, but so far they've moved quickly in the case. In Illinois, organizers are pushing lawmakers to bring up a marriage bill in the veto session that started last week. The session is now on hold and will resume on November 3rd. A new survey in Illinois shows 52% support marriage, with 40% opposed. Meanwhile, legislators in Hawaii are taking a more proactive role, with a hearing on a marriage bill scheduled for Monday, the 28th. If the bill gets passed, then uh, marriages could begin as early as November 18th. A survey by the Honolulu Civil Beat shows opinion split, with support rising and opposition tied at 44%. There's a brand new lawsuit in Tennessee. Four couples, working with the National Center for Lesbian Rights, have sued the state over its marriage ban. A lawsuit in West Virginia has slowed a bit, with the judge granting a clerk's request for an additional two months to file briefs. And Lambda Legal filed a brief in a lawsuit against Nevada's marriage ban. The next step there is a reply brief from the state, which is due next month. Those are the headlines. Subscribe here on YouTube to stay up to date on all these stories. For the American Foundation for Equal Rights, I'm Matt Baum. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week.